Hi everyone, my name is Gabby from the Kia Hyundai channel and today's quick tip and trick is all about the HEV slash EV button in your plug-in hybrid vehicle. Now this will suit both Kia and Hyundai plug-in hybrids and where you'll find this button will vary. Today's vehicle is a Sportage PHEV and it's located just underneath our drive and terrain mode select dial. The button will have an EV at the top with a dash just like a fraction and HEV at the bottom. Every time you press this button, it'll cycle your vehicle either between automatic mode, electric mode, or hybrid mode. Starting off with automatic mode, essentially, it's exactly what it sounds like. The vehicle will automatically switch between either electric or hybrid, which incorporates your gasoline engine. The vehicle will choose which is the better fit based off things like throttle input, if you're flooring it or taking it easy, things like your climate controls as well too, and the slope of the road. When in automatic mode, you'll typically find your vehicle being primarily in EV, provided you have sufficient charge, and when you do encounter things like an uphill or you are giving the vehicle more throttle, it will put you in an HEV mode that incorporates your gas engine. Now, when you put your vehicle in hybrid mode, this will use a lot of EV power still, especially at a standstill. However, it will prioritize most of its energy from incorporating the gasoline engine. EV mode, on the other hand, is fantastic for if you'd like to fully utilize your EV range. So on the Kia Sportage that we have here today, we have about 55 kilometers of all electric range at a full charge, and this will draw most of its power from that supply. Unless, of course, I am flooring it. Now, a couple helpful things to know is even if your vehicle is in EV mode, if you are putting the vehicle through basically pushing its boundaries, it will still draw power from the gasoline engine if it requires it. You may also notice that your gas engine might stay on a bit longer than you would like in EV mode, and that is simply because it is going to make sure the gasoline engine is running enough to complete its full fluid cycles and keep it at a steady temperature. Once this is done, it will again shut off provided you have enough electric range. I hope this video was helpful. If you guys have any other questions, please let us know in the comments down below and I'd be happy to clarify them for you. Make sure you also subscribe because we do videos like this all the time on the Kia Hyundai channel. Bye-bye.